Hey everyone, Flying Dutchie here, and welcome back to Finland in Hearts of Iron 4, Arms Against Tyranny. The war has started, and I think we are ready to defend. Uh, some people told me, Dutchie, you don't have the forts everywhere correctly placed, so let's have take a look together and see if I made a mistake. So, over here we have these two forts. They have to burst through these two. There are two units on each of these tiles, they will have a very hard time. Then over here we have three. This is, this is a lake. Okay, is that a lake or a demilitarized zone? It's a lake. These are all called demilitarized zones. So, this is all defended. And then from this lake to here, we have two provinces defended. This one, this one, and this one. They all have forts. They're all getting built to level 5 at least. And then we have to make a decision. Are we going to build anti-air everywhere or do we go and keep building forts? I think we're going to keep building forts. Let's slow the game down and play. We did put on service by requirement. Uh, the next thing I want, I, I guess, is a bit of war economy. And let's see if we make enough stuff for all the things that we make. We just need uh, manpower, I think, for these divisions. I think we can make at least 10 units. Let's see if we will get the manpower. Uh, let's see how we are doing with our defenses here. So they will move up to these two uh, provinces, that's fine. Um, we do have 1500 defense here. And we have a good soft attack as well. And it's pretty good actually. I like it. And they are not really preparing, so we should have an easy time here defending. Um, at the moment everything is green. Mongolia is in our war as well. Oh, and we can maybe do things now Now we are at war. Let's take a look. War measures. Desperate defense. Oh. For 45 days we get 20% more defense and entrenchment speed. But we need 50% surrender progress. Oh, okay. Uh, woman the workforce. Oh, but we need total mobilization for that, so we cannot do this yet. We have war bonds. The consumer goods factories will go down, but then we need something else. And diversify elite forces. But that is after January. Okay. Now, I thought about something. I don't have an intelligence agency. Maybe we should get it. You know what? Let's go for it. So we can do some spying as well. Uh, that will eat up some of our factories, but we have a full 15 working on Ford, so I guess that is fine. Uh, planes situation. Yeah, we get 200 fighters and 100 support planes above there. And here I have 200 and 470 bombers. They are going to bomb our industry down. Yikes. For now we are really holding, so that is good news. Yes, they will take this very quickly, and then we have to move our troops around. When I can, I will deploy. The manpower is coming in. And what we also can do is change you for a military government. Does that do anything for us? We can get uh, Mannerheim. We get 1% more brutal population. Maybe I will, but not right now. I don't think there's any reason to do it right now. Okay, well let's continue. Looks like it's still all green. Are we killing a lot of people? We have no casualties yet, guys. Why are you attacking? What? Why? Why are you not going? What is happening? Do we need to put these out of the thing?
They need to go here. They need to go to this port. That is so weird. What? What are they doing? Why are they attacking? Why are they not sitting on the port? What is happening, guys? Yeah, go back there. What? What? Are you crazy? Let's take a look here. Yeah, they are attacking me. Now they are attacking me with the tanks. This division can deal 100% of their damage through the armor of the two enemy. Okay, so we do have, uh, when we attack them, we are able to go through the armor of these uh, things. That's interesting. Now we are holding, but for how long? I'm very curious how strong I am. Let's do an attack and see what we can do. Oh my goodness. We are actually able to push through. Yeah, but it doesn't help us at all. Stop the attack, please. There we go. We won, but... <laughs> yeah, we are killing a lot by just defending. So let's keep defending. Are you finally done attacking? I mean, what the hell were you doing? Why were you attacking? They are attacking! I cannot believe it. Well, then I'm gonna make fallback lines. Oh. You guys have to tell me what is happening. I have no idea. Oh, and I should not forget to put the trucks on, by the way. Uh, am I having the trucks on? Yes. Can I get double trucks? Uh, I don't think so. Let's stay with one truck. Uh, you guys, fallback line. On. Pipuri. You, fallback line. On Helsinki. I guess I have to click as well. With control. You guys, fallback line on Turku. And stay there. You guys. Fallback line on Puri. And stay there. You guys. Fallback line on Vaza. No. Not that I should not move. Improved anti-air. Let's go for it. We also have some more traits for... The anti-tank and the anti-air. And the artillery. How can I see which ones I already researched and not? The blue ones? I guess so. I think we want the soft attack bonuses. Maybe we want the, the, the defense here. Then we do this. And then we do anti-tank upgrade. Now I remove them and now I put them on. And the anti-air. Yeah. I guess I did it right now. Okay, um, what do we want now? I guess I'm gonna go and just get all these bonuses. Oh, we have, wait, national defense, what is this? The defense of the Finnish territory and independence is of utmost importance. 
We should be ready to do whatever it takes to defend our people against any external threats. Yeah, but... What? And we can get peace when we control Leningrad. Well, we can try it. It would be really sick, actually. Can we just take... Why are you blinking? We have something new. Improved anti-air. Improved artillery. Ah. Uh, I don't think I have anything new. Okay. I am going to give this a try. Can we attack this? We actually can. Our soft attack is pretty good. It's actually pretty good. And we are piercing their armor, which is also really good. And we are having anti-tank weapons. Interesting. Ooh, what's happening? I don't know. We're losing 9 trucks per day. How much do I make? 2.5 a day. So we are going to lose out of our trucks at some point. Uh, I think we need anti-air everywhere. I think we are somewhat safe. Let's uh, get these anti-airs in our two biggest states. And we can keep our industry going. So you are... Exeburg is getting... Belgium is capitulated. You are actually feeling very good. You are preparing though. Need to watch out and close this gap when uh, they are coming. Need to keep an eye out for that. They could run in with a tank, but I don't think they will. They're attacking me again. Yeah, we have not that much defense now. They have a lot of troops over there. Weapon caches. Luxembourg has capitulated, so the weapon caches is over here. Uh, let's see. We can click these things and we get something. If I click this button, what do we get? Set up weapon caches in Kimi. The cost setup will, uh, will be increased by 5. Active for 30 days. Resistance target plus 15%. Resistance decay speed. Oh, it's for the resistance. Oh. So when we lose territory, we should click this button. I'm not, I'm not a fan of that, actually. No, we don't need trains. We don't need armor trains. Okay. New focus, guys. What do we need? Is there something that we could do only when we are at war? The Nordic Council might might never happen, so we don't have to look at it. Am I going for ships or with aircraft? Absolutely not. Equipment ratio capture is actually pretty good. And the tank thing. Why cannot get this one? We need... The cold front. We need this thing. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Let's get the uh, army upgrades. Now, I want to know if I can deal with this. This attack over here. Which would be crazy. Oh, and I have to click this one and not, not the other one. Uh, we are winning at the moment. We are killing a lot of them. So, that's going very well. And they are attacking me. What if I go and attack Leningrad in a counter-attack? Uh, no. Stop. 
And you can hold this, by the way. Just uh, hold our own core territories. And they are joining us over there. I am waiting. For the manpower. Okay, but some of them do have the manpower, I think. Well... Not really, but we are getting more and more manpower. And we do have, we do have all the equipment, right? Yeah. So, it's going well. We are doing well at the moment. I'm just very careful. No naval invasion happening. Evacuation of children. As the winter war with the Soviet Union rages on, the Finnish government has made the difficult decision to evacuate our nation's children to Sweden for their safety. Save our children. Yes, please. Maybe I should just move... Nah, not yet. Well, actually, they are getting too close now. I am going to remove these seven. And I'm going to make the fallback line. Like this. I need one more unit, I think. You guys are going there. Yeah, we have one, two, three, four, five. So we actually need one of you to go there. I hope we will make this. So just uh, retreat when you can. We will give up the land, but we can hopefully hold all of this. Yeah, you guys should immediately move over there. Need to make sure that we are not gonna lose that. Come on guys, get the manpower in. There's nothing I can click, right? We don't need war support, we have 100. No, I don't think I can click anything. Are we making the anti-air? No, we are still working on a couple of forts and I should continue that. We're going over here. What is this? Officer Corps? Oh, Navy-wise. Yeah, we don't care about the Navy. We don't care! Yeah, and this guy will move over there. Can I just retreat? Yeah, I can, but they are going to do that very slowly. Go here, please. Okay, we are having at least one unit on every fort. The question is, will it be enough? We do have forests and stuff bonus as well. So we do have a huge amount of bonuses. Come on guys, let me deploy. We need them in the field. Well, at least we can hold with one unit. Even with that breakthrough. And I can cycle them through here. So, And this is not even using a fort. So I'm feeling pretty confident that we can hold this line. The defense of, of uh, Finland. I wanted, I wanted to say Sweden. Let's have a look at uh, the world here. Yeah, Germany is just going nuts. And the Axis are owning all of Europe. Because nationalist Spain will, uh, is also fascist. So, I wonder what's going to happen. Come on. They need 20% they need and I can deploy them, I think. Okay. L please tell me we can hold this. Uh oh.
Target location is available. Oh yeah. Uh, yeah, there we go. Click and click. You guys, go over here, please. And first go to the place where they attack you. Improved anti-tank. If I remove this, yeah, it's worse, so it was already active. So we don't have to change anything. Nice. Why are you blinking? What is the new thing that I don't make? I don't get it. We have the improved anti-air, we have the improved artillery, we have the improved anti-tank. Maybe it was still blinking because... No, I don't know. Why are you blinking? I don't know. I don't get it. I just don't get it. Oh well. Uh, 1940. What do we need now? We have enough fuel. It's going very well with all our fuel. R uh, radars? Starting on mechanized. We might build some radars when we are done with our anti-air. Why are you getting attrition over there? Huh. No idea. Okay, we have our agency. Did they change something in this one? I don't think so. Cryptology department. No, let's just do some passive defense at the start. And my spy will of course go to Leningrad. So we can get a small <coughs> bonus there. Okay, we are holding this. And we have a... Naval combat. Submarines are sinking our convoys. We only have this. We only have this guy. I guess I'm just gonna keep them together. <laughs> Maybe strike force over here. Maybe they can help. Well, they are not going. I think. They, no. <laughs> Our boats cannot do anything. Our snipers are proving highly effective. Reports have come in that our snipers are proving highly efficient at fighting off enemy forces and intruding into our forests. Erinomainen. Or, should hand out more arms to the hunters. 1k units of Finnish infantry equipment is removed from the national. Our snipers will become more deadly. Ah. Uh, sure. The dancing ban. As the war continues, an increasing number of politicians and other leading figures are pushing for a ban on public dancing in an effort to show respect and solidarity towards our soldiers fighting on the front. Right. This is stupid or it is not stupid? This is really stupid. <laughs> and yeah, we are losing more and more infantry equipment. Oh, hello. Welcome. That is really nice. Uh, we need one more over here. Please go there. And then I guess... A couple over here. And you guys are gonna go over there. Now one more here. You guys are going there. Why am I having a Soviet song? Go away. I think it is even copyright strike, that one. Shit. There's one song copyright striked, and I think it was that one. 
I should turn that one off. I don't know the name of it. No, no speech. Oh! Help, help here, please. Oh, that's not good. Yeah, they're having supply over there. I could go to war economy. Okay, our forts are all level 5. I could go to level 10, but the thing is, if we lose them, we'll have a problem. But maybe we should try this and hold this province. Looks like they are hammering us down over there like crazy. Gonna get another one over here. Are you gonna use a train or? No. Okay, we have the cold front. Then we have Winter Warfare. Less combat penalties for supply, which is really good. Ooh. I want all these bonuses here. A lock support battalion winter logistics company. What the hell is that? I want to know what that is. Wait a minute. Did they just break in to one of my forts? Yeah. Wait a minute. What happened? Wait a minute, can they walk over the lakes when it is winter? Just like they did in the win Oh no, are you kidding me? Are they just... I can't see it, it's too hard to see. Did they just walk over... The white dead. As, the war, as war has come to Finland, many hunters have taken up arms to fight off their oppressors. Propaganda. Did we just lose this because they walked over the lake? Otherwise, I don't understand. Now uh, you can go here. Did they just walk over the lake? Almina. No. Maybe I just temporarily didn't hit anyone there. That is what I think right now. I'm gonna get it back, so... But what the hell happened there, man? This is a lake. Must be the case that we had um, someone walking there. And temporarily no one on the province. That's the only thing I can think of right now. And it's so white and so hard to see. This 
is the lake, so we don't have to defend here. How did they get here? How could they enter this province? Wait a minute, are you bordering this province? You are! Wait, can they attack over the lake? I'm so confused right now. gonna do this no what did I just click no no oh no did I just change this for wait you have 77 and you have also 7 so it is fine but what the hell I guess this bordering this province. Wow, that's so annoying. Holy shit. Okay, now we have everything locked in. I think. That was really annoying. <laughs> Holy shit. I almost lost everything there. What are you two doing in this army? Go here, please. Uh, okay. I'm completely confused. You guys are only going to do this. Two, four, six, eight, ten. Yeah. Everything is fine, actually. That was really weird. We are fine. Now let's get this uh, this fort up. Oh, we cannot. Uh, okay, we cannot build forts because of an ongoing battle. But if they don't attack me, we will build the entire air. So. Okay, now they are bordering over here as well. Please, can you stand still now? Would be very appreciated. Except for you two, of course, yes. What is this? This is a naval invasion. But I am defending. Oh, what I forgot to do is build uh, coastal forts. Uh-oh. At least we have three already in this port. And we have two levels over here. We have one level over there. Let's get one extra. Let's get two there. And two there. And let's put these up to the front so they cannot naval invade us, really. Or not very easily. Still doing fine. Simoheya, I credit it as the White Death. The Magic Shooter. We can gain command power and 12,000 manpower. Or? No, no, no. Oh my god. We have so much manpower. Defense is not that high. What? Oh yeah, they, they are landing on a province that is... Uh, uh, not a port, so it's not, not a big deal. But we need to get them out of there. How do you help with a battle? Is that Alt-click? Control right click. Yeah. They have no supply over there, so. But they also blocking our supply, which is very annoying. Okay, we are now at our border. You guys are still going over there. Uh, two over there, that's good. Two over that supply up there. All looking good, guys. Still looking fantastic. And yes, we need to build up our economy at some point. 
How many are killed? 56,000. Uh, please help over here before we lose that province. No way. I, I just don't get it sometimes, these these uh, com commands. Now they lost all their uh, entrenchment. Yeah, we need more over here. We might lose that province. Come on, hurry up. We get a spy. Well, you have the most things. And I will put you over in Leningrad. Come on, reinforce. How long is it going to take before you arrive? No way. Oh, we, we are just in time. They are. They keep running away. They are. They are attacking me like crazy. Uh, we might lose with this one. Okay, they have no supplies over here. And they will not get it, I think. So what we can do is make... Uh, get two units out of there. Put them over there. I think because they will not they will have they won't have any supply so they cannot attack me with good force. The only spot where they can attack me with brute force is over here. So we need to hold this province. This is the only province that is hard to to uh, control. This one and nothing else. But the other provinces they have no supplies. We still need more manpower. Yeah, I think one unit will be enough to hold it. We already lost 11,000, unfortunately. Oh, that's not good. I think you guys need to run back to the forts over here. Naval invasion? I think. Did they just kill... No, I don't think they killed people. I only have four... Where are all my six units? Oh, some of them are, of course, still helping over there. You need to wait for the other ones to come over here. Uh, can you go over there, please? Thank you. Okay, we are safe a, a bit again. Doctrine available. Oh yes, we will take this one. Support companies, organization, and soft attack. Fan. Fantastic. Our organization is now going to 55. So we can hold longer. And remember, we can still use our command power as well. Yeah, they will kill our convoys. They took all land. We don't care about that. I really, really hope that we can hold this line here. Really do. Oh, I'm losing my equipment. Why are you still on? Uh, 
I don't get it. Okay, they finally stopped attacking me for a little bit. I am still mobilizing. Okay, it looks like we are holding now. Now some of you are going to this front and I think that's fine. I think this is very important, but we need three units on this tile. But what I'm going to do is pick you and you two and make a fallback line for this province only. Oh, well, I can't. We'll do this. Hey, you three are going over there. Seven, ten. You're saying that you have 15 troops? There are five over here. There are seven over here. It's 12. That's 18. No, I'm... This is, the, this is a separate army. These six. Two, four, six, eight, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. Okay, it's correct. We should try to hold this. Okay, guys, that will be the uh, first episode of, of the war. We almost killed 100,000. We lost 15,000, though. We cannot keep this uh, these losses for the whole game. So I really hope that at some point we are able to, uh, to hold this. We are waiting for Germany to attack, but I think that's going to take a while. And hopefully you will like the video. Give a comment, and I see you in the next video. Bye-bye.